Maria Menounos is opening up about her battle with pancreatic cancer as she's expecting her first child via surrogate. Menounos, 44, revealed she was diagnosed with stage 2 pancreatic cancer in January. The former E. News correspondent said she underwent a successful surgery, with doctors removing a 3.9 cm tumor. I need people to know there are places they can go to catch things early, she said during an interview with People. You can't let fear get in the way. I had that moment where I thought I was a goner, but I'm okay because I caught this early enough. Mayno Unos continued to detail her tumultuous last 12 months, noting, this whole year has been trauma, stress, crisis. I was feeling so good, and then I got slapped in the face with a new diagnosis. I'd scream out loud, I was inconsolable. The doctors also previously told her she had type 1 diabetes, which runs in her family. Once Mayno Unos thought she was starting to heal, she returned to the hospital with excruciating abdominal pain coupled with diarrhea. After taking several tests and x-rays with no results, she said the pain got worse to the point she felt like someone was tearing my insides out. Determined to find answers, Mayno Unos had a whole body MRI. She found out she had a 3.9 cm mass on her pancreas, with a subsequent biopsy confirming that it was a stage 2 pancreatic neuroendocrine tumor, a form of cancer, according to the media outlet. I'm like, how in the freaking world can I have a brain tumor and pancreatic cancer? All I could think was that I have a baby coming, she said. Amid the traumatizing health scare, Mayno Unos and her husband Kevin Undergaro are preparing to welcome a baby girl via surrogate this summer. Undergaro admitted he feared he was going to lose his wife to pancreatic cancer. When the doctors told me that this was what killed Steve Jobs, I froze. But, after a good cry, I realized this is Maria, he exclusively told Fox News Digital. She's taken a lot of hits but keeps moving forward. If anyone can overcome this, she can. And Maria being Maria did. Hoping we can now help others do the same. The Heal Squad podcast host added that she had an incredible support system while she went through multiple procedures. Kevin slept in the hospital every night, Mayno Unos said. And my dad was the best caretaker. In addition to having a tumor removed, part of Menauno's spleen, a large fibroid and 17 lymph nodes were taken out. It was super painful. I couldn't move or lift myself up, she told people. The actress's pancreatic cancer comes after doctors discovered a golf ball-sized brain tumor in 2017. She had surgery to remove the ultimately benign growth. During her health battle, Mayno Unos was also caring for her mother Litsa, who was struggling with stage 4 brain cancer. Litsa died in 2021. While Mayno Unos experienced a series of extreme health conditions, She's always looked on the bright side and feels blessed her baby girl is on the way. I'm so grateful and so lucky. God granted me a miracle. I'm going to appreciate having her in my life so much more than I would have before this journey, she said.